So to move along, uh, up next uh, is Michael Coleman, uh, sales manager for Zamperla, with a very important announcement. Thank you, Ramon. It's an honor to be here today and introduce to you America's newest amusement park, the park at Oa. Maybe tomorrow. The park at Oa is a 14-acre amusement park located in Foley, Alabama. We are currently under construction and this park is part of a much larger development uh, put together by the good folks of CETA, who have been fantastic partners. They are the Creek Indian Economic Development Association. And with 21 rides, this first phase is slated to open on Memorial Day of 2017. Now, the family focus is definitely what we're after, and we did not forget the thrill factor as well. We have a Thunderbolt-style ride anchoring the backbone of the park, running about 803 feet long. Um, you know, to talk a little bit more about the park, I'd like to introduce the president and CEO of CETA, Mr. Tim Martin. Good morning. My name is Tim Martin. I am the president and CEO of Creek Indian Enterprises. It is the economic development arm of the Fort Spanner Creek Indians, a federally recognized tribe in the state of Alabama and Florida. I, my charge is to diversify the tribe's portfolio. We are very successful in gaming. My job is to diversify. But on behalf of the Fort Spanner Creek Indians, some of the ones we have with us today, I'd like to introduce uh, Mr. Keith Martin, one of our tribal council members. Ms. Linda Brooks, one of our board members, and Mayor John Conyer from the City of Foley. This is a true public-private partnership. OWA means big water. It is owned 520 acres in Foley, Alabama, about seven miles north of Gulf Shores, Orange Beach, and our beautiful white sands. We have a healthy market of about 6.2 million people that come in to uh, the area. OWA is an extension of the Fort Spanner and Creek Indians ability to bring family entertainment to South Alabama. To Michael and Delario, it's been a great working relationship. I remember vividly when we sat in our construction trailers and we went and picked each one of those uh, rides you see there being displayed, or why we could do that, why we should do that, why it made, why it made economic sense to do that. We went across and everyone said, well, you pick rides from here, you pick from this company, this company, and this company. We did not. We went with one company, Zamperla. And we put our faith in them, and they are delivering. It is very proud that we are here to be able to help celebrate the 50 years of Zamperla. To Mr. Zamperla and the family, it is great to be here to announce what we're doing with OWA, the Fort Van and Creek Indians, and the success that we're going to go and do in the future. It is, we're going to employ over 3,500 people when we finish out OWA over about a five to seven year period. Hotels, restaurants, dining, entertainment, but the anchor to OWA is this theme park. And we'll have it open this next summer, putting family friendly rides in there. And you'll see that we pick different categories. Big thrill rides for roller coasters, eight mid rides for the, as you see back here, the, uh, apparatus we have going here. Uh, it's been wonderful. The Rolling Thunder, which is the anchor that runs directly through the park, about 14 acres of our 520 acre development that will be there. So it's a pleasure to be here with you. And it's my pleasure to introduce uh, Mr. Samperla for his comments. Thank you, Mr. Martin. 